This is a 62-year-old female. She presents with about a month of pretty intense pain at the insertion of the left Achilles tendon. She suffered from a left ankle sprain about two months before that, but recovered from that injury. She had an x-ray which showed some speckled calcification of the distal Achilles tendon. We went in and we did an ultrasound-guided needle fenestration of the distal Achilles tendon uh, using saline and lidocaine. We tried to break up that calcific deposit in the distal Achilles tendon. And at the three-week follow-up, she was doing great. She felt much better. 62-year-old uh, lady here for pain in her left Achilles tendon, going on for about a month. There was no injury. She did twist her ankle about three or four months ago and, and basically recovered from that. Her x-ray at that time showed a little calcification over the um, insertion of the Achilles, and that's where she's just very tender. Left side of the screen is proximal left is distal. You can see the calcaneus. Um, you can see some calcification there at the insertion. See again some of that distal calcification. You want to make sure you don't mistake the contour of the calcaneus for actual calcification in the tendon. So you can see the Achilles tendon on the top of the screen and Kager's fat pad underneath that. See some thickening of the tendon distally, consistent with uh, some tendinosis. Now we're going to do an axial view. So left side of the screen is lateral, right is medial. See her calcaneus coming into view. Here you can see the little speckles of calcification just above the calcaneus. And then little speckles of calcification. Here's her Achilles, a little bit thickened, you know, distally. And now we're going up proximally. Oops. First thing you want to make sure is you put your needle where it hurts. You're, I'm going to inject her with some saline and lidocaine and just try to break up this calcium deposit. I think that's her tender zone. Yeah, right there. That hurts the most? Oh, yeah. Here's some lidocaine. And we're trying to just go right into that calcium. I can feel it. Oh, I just felt myself break through. Clip. Now we're injecting some saline. Injecting around the calcium deposit. As you inject, you can see that needle much more clearer. Just kind of contrast it out. I'm going back to sagittal now. a little pressure there, huh? Pressure, yeah. yeah. You know, I'm just trying to break it up a little. I can feel a little greediness to it. And also this stimulates blood and healing from that end as well, besides the mechanical breakup of the calcium. For about almost three weeks after a uh, left Achilles uh, tendon uh, needle fenestration, uh, saline injection, lidocaine injection, try to break up some calcium at the insertion. So how are you doing? How's your foot feeling? It's much better than what it was. So that procedure helped? Yes. Excellent. And how soon after the procedure did you notice that? Um, like a couple of days after, like about three, four days after, I could 
walk at it and I wouldn't feel that much pain. Okay. But it's getting better. But so. the pain where, where you had the pain initially, show me where. It's like it's all here. I couldn't put my foot in my sneakers. But now but walk. now but now it's a lot better. It's a lot better. 